All right, DT, your forecasts have been the same thing for a couple of days, and that's good. Mm -hmm. That's a very good thing. He's such a football coach. <laughs> DT. <laughs> yes, hey, I, I like the uh, yeah. initials. That's fine. <laughs> We're going to have beautiful weather, though, as we work our way into the weekend. We've been looking for this for a while, and it's finally here. So, again, just go ahead and make the plan. Do you have any plans? Uh, yeah, i got a coach tomorrow See? morning, and then I've got to watch the Jags, and then i got to watch Alabama. So, a lot of football. Off, so. and a lot of Saints. I'm sure yeah. you have a lot of family plans. You know, I've got the kids. They, the kids. It's like they <laughs> navigate. I just drive and pay. <laughs> <laughs> a good mom, that's right. Let's go ahead and take a look at what's happening out there. You can see we are zoomed in to the Tolmanville area. Good morning to you. The radar scan is looks dry, so you're not dealing with any rain across Donald Street. Have a great day this morning. Temperatures are into the 60s. It's 69 in Mobile. It's a little warmer, though, if you're over at the Mobile, uh, should I say, the Pensacola International Airport. It's 70 there. Still relatively decent. It's much cooler in Evergreen with 61 degrees, and it's 63 right now in Crestview. As far as your weather headlines, it's going to be another beautiful day. We're expecting great sunshine, high pressure, our fair weather friend. It's going to have control, so decent weather for the football games tonight. So if you're heading out that way, no weather worries. And we're going to have a nice fall weekend with mornings each and every day into the weekend, into the 60s. That's going to be nice. Pinpoint predictor showing quiet weather as we start our Friday. That's going to continue into the afternoon. Just a few clouds. That's about it. No weather concerns. Same deal for your Saturday. If you have an early morning event planned, maybe going for a run or just to run some errands, we're going to have decent weather for that. And that's going to follow us into the afternoon. Here's a view around 415. No weather concerns there either. And even as we head into our Sunday, the weather's just going to be a carbon copy. So again, looking great for your weekend. In terms of temperatures, though, for Today, we're going to keep it right around the mid to upper 80s. Averages around the mid 80s, so it's slightly above average in Citronelle with 89. We'll go with 86, though, for those of you in Foley, and we're going to go with 86 for a high today in Grand Bay. North of I-10, temperatures also into the 80s with 88 for Frisco City. Same temperature for Atmore, keeping it at 89 for Chatham with probably cloudy skies. And into our Florida Panhandle areas, we're going to keep temperatures in the 80s here also. We're going to go with 85 for Niceville, so a little bit cooler here. However, if you're up in Jay, we'll go with 87 for you. Same temperature for Pensacola. Cola and even into Mississippi, the 80s will reign supreme. We're going to go with 89 for Marvella, 87 for Moss Point, a bit warmer in Leakesfield. We're going to go with 90 for your high. It's a big football weekend and Ole Miss at Alabama. Here's the forecast for that. We're expecting decent weather for this game as well. It's going to be in Tuscaloosa, kickoff at 530. Here's a view of the conditions. Again, we're going to have mainly sunny skies, high pressure and control of that weather as well, with temperatures that kick off at 79 degrees with an east wind. So here's your seven day. <laughs> Great weather for today. Gorgeous weather for your weekend. Nice and fall-like for sure. As we head into early next week, we will have a chance of rain coming back. But for now, only isolated starting Tuesday.